So you're gonna go from soccer to the airport. Okay, do you want um, you want one braid or two? <laughs> Nora, are you gonna wear your magic shoes? Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Alexa, turn off the lights. Okay, Taylor, hold it down. Thing. You carry your cherry, or want me to carry it? It's chair, it's a kitty. You're all set, Nora. <laughs> Mad, did you tell him thank you? Okay, good job. First, I'm going to go tell your coach thank you for coaching this season, and I'm going to say bye, and then I'm going to go. Appreciate hey, thank you for the season. Yes, sir. Appreciate it. Yes, sir. All right. Be good for mom. Thank you, Daddy. Love you. He's going to be gone. Okay, come here, Nora. I you going to be gone for Alfred? Just, I'm um, coming home tomorrow. Okay. Okay, be good for mom, okay? Okay. Okay. Love you, Nora. A little training the day before. Get loose, basically. Some light weights, feel good. So straight from the, basically straight from the airplane to the training hall. This is it. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna get warm up, make sure I feel really good, hit some light lifts, and I'm just kind of basically ready to go tomorrow. Let's go, man. Good. Good. I, I told you. Oh, it's time to fire. Hold up. Gone. Congratulations, man. Thank you so much. Very cool. Just play the game right. No one can Oh, it's time to fire. Hold up. Oh, it's time to fire. Hold up. Perfect. 90.1. We've been here for a few hours, went and did a little lifting to loosen up, went to the grocery store and kind of got food that we need tomorrow after our weigh-in. One meatball. And now the goal is to do as little as possible. Um, try and stay off my feet, try and relax, um, nothing too stressful. I just woke up this morning. It's like 8.30. I um, actually woke up at 7, went back to bed. So I, I was in bed, I think, like uh, almost 11 hours, which is the longest I've been in bed that I can remember. Um, normally, I get up, like I said, at 4.30 or 5 every single day, same time. Um, but since we're competing today, I want to make sure to get well rested. So I'm going to check my weight and basically find out if I can eat anything today. This perk's right on. Yeah. All right, right on weight. I, uh, so that's good because also I don't have to have my underwear on my way in. So that means I'm probably actually just like a little bit under. So I have like half a cup of coffee, so I'm gonna headache, a little couple pieces of chicken or like a hard boiled egg or something like that. So actually, things look pretty good. Right up, right on try. So it's almost two o'clock, two hours before I lift, and that's when weigh-ins are. So we're gonna head down right now, actually do the official weigh-in. Doesn't feel like it's been like four years, you know? All right, good to go. 88.73, so I got room to spare. So uh, let's get back to the room, eat a little bit, get ready to go. First one. Thank you. Stretch 
out a little bit. My singlet on. I uh, head down now, meet up with uh, Kaleo, he's going to be coaching me, a uh, Cal Strength teammate, and then just kind of look at the plan, see what's going on. I do like that. Talk about like different art, you know, like abstract or not, like. Well, let me go into these first. Oh, yeah. How you doing? I'm good, buddy. Hey, congratulations. Thank you, dude. Oh, man. Have some fun. Crazy. I brought you some treats, dude. I love treats. Sour Patch Kids for both of you guys. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's... I'm going to wait. I don't oh, want to get all pumped yeah. up yet. Oh, God. I'm huge. <laughs> Bar 50, 70, 90, 110, 20, 30, 40. Nah, yeah, something like that. But that 40 we may not take if we open like 137. Or, or if it's like going to be 143, that 130, that could be 135. That'd be fine. I've been doing some visualization. I heard that helps. Yeah. <laughs> Visualizing. I visualized winning and I got second place. Mm, maybe it doesn't help. Maybe I waste <laughs> my time. Okay, we're ready for our session 19 on the red platform. In the 89 kilo category from the United States of America, Danny Lair. Time starts for Acosta, 111 kilos. Lair next at 113. Time starts for Danny Lair, 113 kilos. No lift by majority decision for Danny Lair. I felt pretty good warming up. I went out there, my first attempt. Uh, I thought I made it. Um, I felt, I know my elbows are straight, but I got a red, two red lights, so the lift didn't count. Um, Cause you have to have like one continuous motion, some stuff like that. And uh, we'll tighten up 113 and give Danny two minutes to come back and make that same weight or make a change. Time starts for Danny Lair, 113 kilos. Third lift for Danny Lair at 113. 118, please. 118. Time starts. Danny Lair, 118. Third lift for Lair at 118. So I made the one snatch. Um, so that's okay. At least I'm in the game. Yep, we're here. So we're, we're okay. You'll be on the track. Time starts for Danny Lair, USA, 137. Good lift for Lair at 137. Time starts for Danny Lair. 144, 144 please. That is a good lift for Danny Lair at 144. Loaders 145, 152, third attempt. 153, 153. Good lift, but down there at 153. I was planning on opening round 146, uh, maybe 143, 146, but 137 was what I needed for the win, so the same thing. Um, in fact, 137 would give me like a seven kilo cushion over the next guy.
And in first place, our gold medal champion with a total of 266 representing the United States, Danny Lair. Cal Strength teammates on my weightlifting team, uh, Wes Kitts, he got gold at Pan Am Games. Um, after winning first, they play they play the national anthem of whoever wins gold. Uh, and I remember thinking, man, like, man, that's gotta be really cool. They're playing that song because he won. And I remember kind of mentioning that to him, man, that's cool, you know. Um, anyway, then here we are a couple, about a couple months later, I actually did have that opportunity, something I didn't know if I was going to. It's a really cool opportunity. So overall, really cool meet, man. Um, I just want to change out of this sweaty ass singlet, and then uh, then we got to go to the fucking airport, fly back home, so I can get up tomorrow morning and uh, see my wife, take the kids to school.